photos. Tenable visit audio of Carlos' mother. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. The presidential candidate of the All Progressives Congress, Mr. Ahmed Bola Tenable, paid a cutting visit to Elder Mrs. Eunice Uzokalo, the mother of the Chief Whip of a Night Senate, Senator Audio Zokalo, on Sunday, 18th of September, 2022. According to the post, Shared on his verified Facebook page of the Senator Audio Zocalo, the former governor of Lagos State, visited the Senator Carlos Mula in the company of the Speaker of House of Representatives, Honorable Femi Bajabiamila. Senator Audio Zocalo's post reads: APC presidential candidate and but and by God's grace, the willing and by God's willing, the next president of Nigeria. Ahmed Asiwaju Bola Tarambo this evening paid a courtesy call to my mother, Elder Mrs. Eunice Uzokalu. With Asiwaju was the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Femi Bajapiamina. The visit could be connected with Tarambo's presidential ambition come 2023. The All Progressive Congress presidential candidate has been going about the length and breadth of a country in a bid to converse for support in his quest to become the president of Nigeria. Just yesterday, he was in Gombe, where he attended the wedding of a son of Gombe State Governor and also paid the custody to the Emir of Gombe. Well, it is not the first time I'm going to be hearing this. Why? Because I think early last year, when Oji Zocado was speaking about him running for the elections or not, you know, he mentioned... I mentioned that um, he mentioned that um, him and Tinubu were quite close. That you know Tinubu even come to his house. So this is um, should I say this is a this is just like an a nod that okay, well, true, true, that they go visit this person. That is what is being seen here. That they go visit this person. Well, um, this is not a bone of contention. Tinubu instead of going up and down should come and tell us you know what exactly is going to be doing. How is he going to be going about it? When is he going to be doing what he will do? What are the strategies of making Nigeria a better country? Does she have them? You see, I'm coming out to attack Tunumbu with things like this. Sincerely, you know, Mick, I still feel this particular news now that he visited Oji Zokado because many people, a whole lot of people, are coming out to say, oh, what is he doing? He's going, no, no, no. Now, this vis this particular visit to Oji Zokalo would not have even made it to the news. Had it been, he was not contesting. But because he was contesting, hmm, it has made it to the news. Now, the thing is, I don't know what they were thinking when releasing this news. I mean to the camp because I want to I want to be certain. I want to I want I am certain that it was actually them that released it. Now, let I told I said earlier before that early last year Tunubu, I mean, Oji Zokalo came out and said Tunubu was, is his very, not was, is his very close friend. And that Tunubu normally comes to their house. So this is what we are just seeing here. It should not be propaganda to say, oh, I don't know, but it is not propaganda. But if they want to use it as, I don't know. But the thing is, Tunubu has already, I mean, Oji Zokalo has already come out to say that Tunubu was really his best friend from years back. So... Whether he will visit in best friend mama or whether he no go visit in best friend mama, it's nothing. It's inconsequential here. The most important thing to us is that is the person is is um, what's it called? Is a Siwaju Bola Ahmed Tunubu. Is he credible? Is he cap? Is he does he have the capacity to make Nigeria a better person? Now be the question, not whether he visited. Sincerely, all we need to know is how did he fare before. Did it feel good? Okay, no problem. What about now? What about um now? What about now? You know? What does it do now? Is it still that same person now? Does it run the same, you know? It's it's that is how what we should be looking at. Not whether you know he visited anyone or not. World leaders do not vote in Nigeria election won't have to be elected president before consultation of world leaders. Hmm. Trisha. Joy Bukwe should acknowledge. Oh, okay. No, no. No, 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 no. 
Now the thing is, he visited Ojizokalu, which I feel there is nothing wrong with that. In fact, I even reminded us that Ojizokalu have come out in the past to say that Tsunambu actually is his friend. So him coming to visit him was like, you know, it is, it is something that is absolutely normal to do, if you ask me. It's absolutely normal. Okay. Oji will win his Senate side with hard work and money, but Tsunambu will not get up the 20 votes in Abiyo North. Mark my words. Are you really serious? We are not just busy visiting world leaders to build up international ties for the good of this country. He pays the people who make on a see where on a country they do his own constitution. Well, as I say it again, Hadi Bin Tinubu is not coming out or is not a presidential candidate. I do not think he, this particular visit now will make it to the news. It will not. All right. So leadership of this country is now turn by turn. Whoever is going to rule this country come 2023 you should know that by 2031 it will be my turn to turn this country from production to becoming the most powerful nation on earth. Not even USC will see our back. So help me God. Amen. <laughs> All right. He visited the mysterious woman, the, the woman whom OBJ bowed to. She is the pillar of her son, Ojikalu. She performed the first lady of Abia State when her son was governor. Carlo's wife ended up only in the kitchen and the other room. Tsunambu, no matter the juju she gave you, you will never be president. Yay. You never reach like this. Now make another take him easy. If he likes it, she visit our ancestors looking for you. Ha, my goodness. Not so much. She's actually, she's, she has made every political experience in Nabia loyal to their government. The bone of contention here is, all oh, this is inconsequential. I will say for the 1,000th time that if... But Ahmed Tsunambu was not a presidential candidate, or he was not running, yes, this year. This visit would not have been brought out. Because I read last year about Oji Zokalo. And Oji Zokalo, you know, he came out and it was all about how Tsunambu used to come to their house, how they were friends. I think then he was contemplating whether to run or not. As a then or he was contemplating. So, like I said earlier before, this particular issue, it, it no need, no need to come out. Sincerely, what I've said it before, what we need to be talking about is how these people will come in and make our lives better. What what solutions are they bringing to our problem? How are they going to be going to the solutions? What strategies do they have? How do they test run a strategy? You know, if they're bringing in one particular solution, for how long are they going to test run it? For six months, for nine months? Let them come and give us, not us all, you cannot have all the answers to their problems with developing the country. But at least if they have four to five, that's a very good start. Or they have three to four, that's a very good start as well. So these people should come out and tell us things like, you know, this is what the double said he would do. And not just what he said he would do. He himself should come out, you know, and tell us himself what he stands to do, what he's going to be doing, what he would do. You know? That is what we. That's that is what we are. I don't know about you, but that is what I really. I'm really interested in. All right. He's another. Okay. Let him continue to work out from one place to another to buy a favor. Old man stressing himself because of things of the world. Why not they like this? Why not they like this? Eh, Nigerians. Well, the truth about him is, come to it in the free. We are going to see the people who are giving him support or not. All right, on this note, we've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for turning in to listen. Until I come here next time, enjoy.